Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon, Dimas. Good afternoon, Dimas. How are you today? I'm fine. Oh, I'm good. And how about you, Dimas? Yeah, I'm good too. Thanks. Uh, so right now, I'm doing a research about college college student opinion about online class. Uh, I want to ask you too about how do you feel about studying in online class? Uh, I would like to ask Pipit first. I'm okay. Um, how do you feel about the online class? Yes. Um, as we know, uh, because this is for the first time for us studying online because this pandemic situation. And uh, of course, uh, I feel something new. And for me, this is my first and new experience. This is not too bad, but uh, you know, I really miss my friends and all about my campus life. How about you, Kash? Um, uh at the first time of the pandemic situation uh, i feel like it is uh real it is not a good thing for me because i'm not used uh being on a camera uh but uh, at the end of the day until this day uh it's all fine for me and also it is a new experience for me as you know that the class is usually have the asynchronous and synchronous class uh what application that suits you the most with the synchronous class mm, cash flow first i think um for the synchronous class uh, i prefer use zoom application because it is the most uh the most lectures uh, the most application that uh, being used by lecturers in online class, especially. And then um, it also has many features than the other application, I think. And um, even though it has a limited time for the free users, but uh, for me, it is not a problem. How about you, Pippin? Um, okay, I agree with Castile opinion. For the synchronous class, I prefer Zoom application. Um, I have a reason why I choose Zoom application because uh, this application is commonly used by our lecture. So um, we more familiar with it. And I think it make it make us uh, more easier to use this application than others. What about the synchronous class, Pepit? Um, for the asynchronous, I prefer Google Classroom. Uh, maybe the reason is the same with the synchronous class because uh, this application is commonly used by, by our lecture. So uh, we're more familiar with it. And I think uh, this application is more flexible, more efficient than others. So we can use or open this application anytime and anywhere. And then um, uh, there are many advantages of this application. So make, make we use it often. Yeah. How about you? Um, uh, for me, same as Pipit, Google Classroom is the best uh, option for the uh, asynchronous class. Because uh, when I used, uh, as a student, when I use uh, this application, I feel like it is a real-time class, just like the um, offline class, because I can give my assignment and also the lecture uh, give the response uh, fastly. So yeah, that is the best choice uh, for asynchronous class. I would like to ask Kashville, uh, is it hard to adapting in online class? Oh, for the first time uh, in online learning, for me, uh, ad adapting in online class is a hard 
a thing to do because um, as I said before in the beginning of this uh, interview, um, it is, uh, I'm not used to uh, being on a camera, but um, until this day after a one year of this uh, online learning, I feel like it is just a common thing. So it's now it's uh, fine. How about you, Peter? Is it hard to adapt in a main class? Um, yeah, it is. Um, for the, the first time uh, in the beginning, I had a struggle with this situation um, because as we know, this is for the first time situation like this. And I haven't been able to adapt with this condition, but as, as time went on, I was able to adjust everything, Dimas. Interesting. Um, how about the government support? What do you think about the government support, Pipit? Oh, for the government support, um, yeah, I I have heard uh, a few weeks ago about it, about the news, and I think that's a uh, interesting news and. You know, I really happy to hear that um, because uh, for me as a student, the government support is really needed. And Alhamdulillah, a few days ago, I had uh, I had received assessment from the government support that is a uh, quota subsidies, and I think it was very helpful, Dimas. Oh, I see. How about you, Kashmir? Um, honestly, uh, I didn't uh, follow the government support, uh, but I know the information about it. So, uh, but um, because I have a Wi-Fi in my home, so I'm not uh, take that support. Uh, I prefer to give that support to the uh, other students uh, that uh, didn't have the chance to get the support. So, um, yeah, it is, but overall, um, it is a good thing from the government to support the students, uh, especially in this pandemic situation. I see. Um, since it's been a year about the online class, which one do you prefer, online or offline class, cash fail? Uh, about the offline or online class, I prefer offline class, of course, because I can interact with my friends, with my lecturer exclusively, and then um, yeah, I can socialize with others. I I get I can get a new uh, environment, a new experience, and um, but again, uh, this pandemic just. Uh, ended in the online learning so yeah yeah um, how about you baby um i agree with cashville um of course i prefer offline class um, because when i go to campus i can meet with my friends of course my lecture and many others and when I ride my motorcycle uh, on the way, I can see the beautiful view in Karawang, Dimas. <laughs> I think that's a interesting uh, moment. Yeah, I miss it all. I see. So guys, it's, that was the last question about our interview. Um, thank you for your time and good afternoon. Um, good afternoon. Okay, Dimas. Dimas. Good afternoon. Thank you.